Hello and welcome back. In the last video I showed you you can be able to check the email address that was used to open your KRI PIN. So in this video I'll be showing you how to, you can be able to check if the KRI PIN that you have is active or not active. Because some of the KRI PINs are inactive. For example you have not filed for a long time. Maybe it was opened maybe before uh, 2015 and you have never even attempted to update the KRI PIN or anything of that sort. So that means that the KRI PIN number can be either inactive or active. So without wasting much time, uh, let's uh, get started. So the first thing you come to this website, uh, itax.kri.go.ke. I leave the link in the description down below. Then don't enter anything on this side. Just enter. Uh, click where it says pin checker or to verify pin click here after that enter your KRI pin number here after entering now your KRI pin number then solve the security stamp for me it's uh, 42 then click consult when you click consult down here it will bring a pop-up menu uh, with a lot of information the first thing is the KRI pin number the second name uh, thing is the uh, the uh, the person uh, name of the person that it is registered to. Then the most important thing that we are interested in is the PIN status, which is active, and also it will uh, ITAC status. It is registered. Down here it will show you some other few uh, options or some other few more info, uh, information or details where it says uh, obligation uh, name. So it is uh, income tax, residence individual, then current status, registered, then effective date from this one, it was opened this day, then the date to which it may expire, but this one may not even uh, appear in that list. So basically that's you can be able to check if your KRI pin is active or inactive, or if it is in use or it is no longer being used. Thank you so much for watching. See you in the next video.